And that's a surprisingly easy way to get out of a secure government facility. Okay, you need to find Tracer Tom. He used to drop Paul off in a small compound east of the market. You could start there. Don't lose any time. Their kill switch is 12 hours old. If you die, our plans will fail. Okay, Tracer Tom. No one cares about me. They only care about my in integ in 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 integration into their plans. So, we are now in Hong Kong, which has an amazing soundtrack. But what we do have to worry about is it also has those acoustic gunfire sensors that uh, we read about before. There's another sword if you didn't pick one up inside. Baton if you want one of those again. And a lockpick. Um, so yeah, using guns here will turn all the police hostile, so you have to be careful of that. There's a popo. Uh, this is just kind of a little police way station that we will actually be getting into later on. Oh, hold on. What's this madness? How do I get in there? Oh! I see some shenanigans here. Oh, really? Whatever, I got 20 of these. I don't know if the code for this exists somewhere, but... No matter. I've never actually found this before. Gas grenade. Oh, a replacement. Fancy that. Don't need any of that crap. I'll take these, though. Police substation is 911. Huh. Isn't that amusing? Uh, hey, dog. Hey, cat. This must be some little uh, pet shop. Bird cage with nothing in it. All right, no matter. Pottery. Hand china, very authentic. Oh yes, it's quite nice. Bah! Sounds like tin, though. You are cheap. Uh, it's just an advertisement, don't care. These two are annoying, don't care. Uh, so. Yes? You're next to the compound Paul used to visit, but I don't know who it belongs to. I think I'm clear now. Good thing the NSA invested in stealth technology. Oh, yes. What irony. So, this is the Tong compound. Let's see what we got here. My brother's name is Paul. Haha! <laughs> Getting off the coast there, JC. This compound. You know him? The Rumonos path is crossed to Guaylos. Paul is no friend of the West. My name is Gordon Quick. I know your brother, but you are not him. They say you are royal to Monatko. I was, before Paul showed up in New York. A day later, I was helping the NSF. You want me to take your word? You are in Hong Kong now, and we are businessmen. Paul earned our trust by working with us. I don't have time for games. No games. We would like another ally like Paul. The trials are at war, thanks to a woman named Maggie Chow. A sword was stolen from the Red Arrow Triad, and Miss Chow started the war by braving us, the Romanus path. Why is one sword so important? It is an extraordinary sword called the Dragon's Tooth. Nanotechnology developed by the Red Arrows for Morida before he was murdered. We know that Chao is a Raya, but we have no proof. I'll go speak to her, but first I need to find a man called Tracer Tong. I need his help. Mr. Tong deals with businessmen, not beggars or strangers who might be spies. Chao lives at 1313 Tonochi Road. Be observant. Find and examine that sword. It is the evidence we need. I'll help you against Miss Chao, but then I'll need to see Tong or I won't be your ally for more than about 12 hours. She said no. Impossible. Get out of my way, kid. So that's that. Of course, it's never simple. We have to do some business before uh, we can actually do what we need to do here. If you head down here, it's actually pretty cool. There's a bit of a sword fight going on. There's the Red Arrow Triad versus the Luminous Path Triad. 
Luminous past are slightly... Oh. I thought they were outnumbered, but that guy snuck up on me. Well, he was a, he took a lot of sword hits. But he's not uh, not holding up, I'm, f I'm afraid. Uh, if you want another... If you haven't found a sword yet, you can pick up one up from these guys. Any of them who die. Stay out of business. I'll say all your business. Uh, what we really came down here is this ATM. We'll be back down in these tunnels at a later date, but... It's never the wrong time to make a withdrawal. Alright. Ooh, what's down here? I see a thing. Lockpick! Sweet. We got that. And now we have to go find Maggie Chong, uh, who is apparently stirring up a war between the triads over a sword. She's also supposed to have been a former ally of uh, Paul's. No, I don't. Oh, so close. I can get you. I know I can. Oh, so so close. Another one. I'll get you. Oh, fuck it. Sensitivity is too funky. Yeah, right back at you. Old China Hand. I believe that's just some kind of like a cafe or market or something, but it's irrelevant to us. We need to get across this canal to uh, find Maggie Chow. This canal is a bit of an interesting place. There's actually a lot to find here. Uh, but we have quite an urgent mission. Oh, well, here's the old China hand. We'll be back here later. Some interesting stuff happens, but I do not care enough. Oh, that guy's coming for us. Paul Denton, I have the blueprints. I must warn you, I... Oh. Warn me about what? I have made a mistake. Paul's my brother. What's the problem? No, I have made a mistake. Hmm. No, I am sorry. I would really like to know what he had for Paul. But he will not tell us. Have you guys just taking pigeons off the streets and serving them? Apparently in some cultures they actually really do do that. Pigeons are almost a delicacy. But that's not what we're here for. We need to get across this canal somewhere. I'll find it eventually. Uh, for some reason, one of the bridges is just destroyed. And it serves no purpose other than to be a pain in the ass. I was walking here. Were ya? Get out of my way. Don't talk to me like that. Oh, he has lockpicks and a 40. Whatever. I don't want to actually kill the dude. I am not a murderer. Uh, is there anything down there? Somewhere around here is a boat. And on it is a lady who sells some black market goods. And then somewhere else is a, a barge with some stuff inside that you can take which we will do later this is where Maggie Chow lives don't know the name of the place Welcome to Queen's Tower, Queen's Tower. alright thanks um, not important there's some money on the table uh, we can hack this if we want um, I don't think it's really too helpful. This does open a back way into Maggie Chow's place, but... If we go in from the front... Oh, uh, if you want, there's actually... Yeah, there we open a back way. And the uh, rest of these cameras... Really, none of the cameras are that important. But, there. They're closed. If you want to do this quick, you can actually just go in the back way. And, uh... 
in, in just sneak into Maggie Chow's place. You don't have to do anything else. But I'll do it the normal way. Which is pretty much the diplomatic way. You talk to her first. I'm looking for Maggie Chow. You must be Mr. Denton. Miss Chow has been expecting you. She is waiting in the living room. Please follow me. But expecting you? How the hell did she know I was here? Man, everyone seems more informed than I. I will accompany you. Accompany me. I think if you hurry and walk past her, she might actually, like, take that as a threat and start shooting or something. I had that experience Those once, at least. Were made by hand in Tibet. Actually, that might have been when I uh, just started wandering around here without permission. Mr. J.C. Denton, in the fresh. <laughs> as dark and serious as his brother. That is so racist. And Paul, you know my brother? Intimately. Call me Maggie. Paul never mentioned you. That is why he is still alive. He can keep a secret even from his own brother. But why... Paul told you about Majestic 12, correct? The conspiracy behind you, Natko? Just the name. Majestic 12 sent Paul to murder the former Red Arrow leader. And me too. And he double-crossed them? Let's just say I persuaded him to join our side. What does Majestic 12 want with the Red Arrow? We are winning the Triad War against Majestic 12's ally, the Luminous Path. We were developing a new technology. You might have heard about a sword. The Dragon's Tooth, right? The Triad settled disputes in contests of skill, which includes the crafting of weapons. The Dragon's Tooth would have made us unstoppable. So Majestic 12, you're trying to tip the balance, give the Luminous Path a technological advantage. Exactly. I try to warn the people of the danger. And the Luminous Path calls me a liar. The police have all the evidence they need to settle this, locked up in the station at the Wan Chai Market, but they will not act. Go and see. I know the code to their vault. 87342. It's only fair to tell you that I spoke with Gordon Quick before coming here. I thought he was a friend of my brother's. I agreed to visit you and learn the truth of the situation. Yes, you were seen. The new Red Arrow leader is Max Chen, and you don't have to go to the Lucky Money for him to know your activities. Now tell me about Paul. Why did he not return? Paul's on his way to Hong Kong. I don't know when he will arrive. Then you must think for yourself. In Hong Kong, the truth is seldom kept in plain sight. Indeed. Let's take a look around. Alright, I'll do that. So, this is where it gets a bit interesting. I don't understand... Oh yeah, she follows you. And uh We have many prize Buddhas you will observe. I have observed. If you uh kinda of start invading Chow's privacy too much, she will get pissed off. The floor coverings were made by hand in Tibet. Congratulations. You said that already. Uh but it's not important that we do it now. We can we'll be coming back here later. So let's GTFO. We'll get to that police station. And that'll be that. Actually, it won't quite be that. As the plot will thicken ever more. It seems... Well, this dude is you not very subtle. Face, I'm here on business from Gordon. You are here to speak to Miss Chow. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, the that's not in... important. I don't give a shit. Uh, so, yeah. Chow sends us to the police station. But I don't really understand why, because all we find there is evidence to incriminate her. So it seems a bit... I don't know, maybe she was hoping that we would get ourselves killed trying to break in, but... There are easier ways to deal with us, I imagine. She gave us the code to the vault, but not to actually get inside the place. But we did find the code to get inside the place. It is... 911. Alright, uh, unfortunately, there is a cop there. I don't know if these acoustic sensors are sensitive enough to pick up silenced shots. But without... Without... Well, now I'm kind of stuck in here. Without the riot prod or anything to really stun this guy, I've got no choice. Unless I want to...
Ah, uh, yep, they're onto me. All right. Whoa, hey, buddy. You are extremely tough, my friend. How the hell do you survive a direct shot to the face? Hello. Right, well. So, we have sorely pissed off the cops. Oh. What? You kidding me? I could get up here and then just... Really? How the hell does a shot to the face? Alright, well, I guess there is no actual way to get up here. But how the hell does a shot to the face not kill these fools? That pisses me off. So like half the time it doesn't work. Alright, well, let's have this locked and loaded in case we have to fight our way out some more. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. Uh, let's do with this. If you were able to quietly take down that one cop, the rest of this should not be too hard. Actually, you need to take down the second one quietly as well. Turn off all the cameras, which really does not benefit us at all. Oh, that's how we could have opened that without a, without a lockpick. That doesn't matter. We have 20 again, so... Yeah, you have, if you want to get into this, you have no choice but to get the code from Mega Chow. 87342. Yeah. Now there should be a data vault down here. I have enough of uh, that ammo. You will find a surveillance report for the activities of Maggie Chow. Chow's associated with Red, tri Red Arrow Triad and Max Chen are a matter of record. However, recent evidence indicates she may have also been involved in the death of Chen's predecessor, Yuan Kong, contributing factor to the current gang war. Miss Chow and her relationship to the Versa Life Corporation are also under investigation. Shows a high probability of being linked to the recent conflict between the triads. Several tactical options for accessing Mrs. Chow's penthouse. Service entrance at the rear, renovation project in progress on the building's seventh floor, and the roof. Mm hmm. So that was a pretty stupid move on her part. Like, really, I don't know why she sends us uh, saying that there's evidence of. I don't know. I don't really know her motivation. But that did tell us there are a couple ways to get into Chow's place. Other than the direct route. Um, but it's not really that important. These things, in spite of being, you know, linked with the police, they actually don't... They don't actually do anything... Uh, when the police are mad at you, which is strange. That guy's a flamethrower. That does not seem like standard issue police wear, but... Well, this is future Hong Kong, so what do I know? If we go the direct way back into Maggie Chow's, there's not much that uh, really happens except... Actually, I think the direct way is a bit tougher to uh, do in the end, so taking the service entrance in the back might be what we end up doing. I just want to go in the front way. Which is probably the way that most people are going to go the first time. Who's there? Well, that was a bit of a... bit of a sign. MJ-12 Troop. Shouting at me, because you heard my footsteps. I'm sorry. Miss Chow is not at home. Yeah, well, tell her I know she double-crossed the Red Arrow, and I intend to prove it. You are mistaken, Miss Chow. She should never have sent me to the police station. Now I know she's hiding something and I intend to find out what it is. No, no, you are mistaken. Guards! What guards? Whoops, whoops! That's a bit overkill. Huh. 
Well, she called for the guards, but they're not coming out of their hidey hole. Let's just take a bit of a look around. I can't break through that. I thought there might have been a hidden passage or something. Uh, somewhere in here is some interesting stuff. Oh. July 18th. Don't know how that's relevant. Let's just hack this. That's probably a clue as to a password or something, but I don't give a shit. MJ12 net. There's yet another really incriminating sign of her underhandedness. What's important from here, we can do this, but there is another security terminal inside this uh, secret lab here that we can use, but whatever. We get out of the way early. Uh, in here is a kitty cat. Make sure you don't... Oh, wow, the cat's already mad at me for some reason. I ain't done nothing to you. Alright, nothing in here. I don't want to step on you, so stay out of my way. No, that's not out of my way. Please, I don't want to step on you. There. I harmed myself to save you. Stupid cat. I like animals, I don't like hurting them. Which happened too often in The Witcher 2. Geralt was a bit too bloodthirsty. Now the back way in, it's just around here. We opened it from the uh, security terminal on the ground floor there. That big security bot is actually no problem at all. There's nothing to stand in your way. Uh, there's, a, there's a keypad there. But you kind of have to be careful because it brings down a lift somewhere. Which way did we come from? We came from there. What if we go down here? Don't actually seem to be anything down here. What is the point? All right, uh, I don't think we got the information for this. But, uh... One tool is enough to do it. Gotta be a little bit careful, because... Oh, that's it. Okay. We are on the lift. Don't crush me. Okay, thank you. Where the hell am I? Oh, there we go. I believe there are any guards on the rooftops, but... Three tools? Well, here's that. There's gotta be a password to that one. I don't want to waste all my tools on it, man. July 18th, maybe that's it. 718. Sweet! I am a fucking genius. You know what? Do I even give a shit? I don't think I do. Is this maxed out? Could have sworn this held 12. Yeah, I thought so. 718. I feel like I feel way smarter than I should for knowing that. That's completely pointless. Or maybe not. It seems like someone's coming to greet us. I see you! Yes, Private, it's me. Oh, he had a plasma rifle. That's dangerous. Okay, this is a bit, bit of a shit. He can't hit me from there, fool. Nope. No squad for you. Let's have that at the ready. Should have activated it a minute ago, but I am too... Too slow to react. Ah, oh, they're both already uh, on, the, on the run. Come on, I want this guy's stuff. 
So yeah, one of those guys had a plasma rifle if you want to pick that up, but that's not not too helpful for me. Let's have our weapons locked and loaded. There might be more soldiers. I don't immediately know. I'll have that. Thank you. Ooh, 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 that's got some uh grenade or some uh, assault rifle grenades. That'd be quite handy. Oh really? Damn it, I want I wanted to load this shit. Uh that's a clip. Let's put it in that. That's probably where it's going to be the most helpful. Get as many shots in that as we can. Ms. Chow, we are reassigning you temporarily. Put the long-term agenda on hold until Versa Life has met its deadline. It will be months and probably years before the Red Arrow can influence Beijing, whereas, well, I'm sure you heard about my appointment. We are in position to make a grab for Washington. We can't let this one slip through our fingers. Make sure the process stays on schedule. Over and out. So there's just the final nail in the coffin. She is directly working with Walton Simons himself. That's no good. Greetings, Jesse Tim. I have been observing you through this fascinating device in your skull. You have found the proof we needed. The That's a bit scary, actually. Sword. If you wish to be my ally, you will retrieve the sword and await my instructions. Roger, over. You can read that if you want, even though the text is very, 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 very small. Uh, just Maggie Chow interrogating someone. And cutting off their fingers. Which is just a sign. Maggie Chow is supposed to have been like an actress or something like that. Now we can check her email. Alright, whatever. Don't have time for that. Shoot. Well, if you can't hack, then you can just try and use that, which is, uh, takes more tools than I care to use. Perhaps. Oh, what can we be rid of? Nothing, really. I want all of these things. I feel like these are probably the least valuable. Anything that that would work on can also be destroyed with a rocket. Now we have the badass sword. A sword so badass it can actually make corpses explode. Wah! Ha ha! This pleases me. 